Hey, Internet, I uh, just got this brand new game from Nintendo uh, called The Legend of Zelda. It's a really hot ticket item right now. Very hard to find. And just look at these graphics. They're lush. They're beautiful. This is a really big game, like a really big game. You got your like coastal area. You got like forests that go on forever. You got mountains that are mazes that go on forever. We just loop over and over from screen to screen. You've got uh, dungeons you can't find. All in all, I'd say I can kind of see why all the publications and everybody's raving about this game. It is pretty amazing. It's open-ended. You just start and you go. It's It's got multiple dungeons. They're spooky. These guys look pretty rad. What on earth? You got these centaur dudes that have swords for arms that shoot other swords out of their dick. There's a triceratops. You got this claw spitting thing that dies to one bomb hit one hit one hit i could have beat this guy gotta say i feel like there's been a few oversights here in the development of this game even though it's brand new it's missing a lot of what we expect in today's games why why do i have to push this block to unlock these stairs why is this piece of mountain blow upable but only from this specific spot who who the hell would know about this cave is this your plan nintendo to just fuck with kids heads and why do i gotta pay this extortionist to tell me something i already know pay me and i'll talk i already know about the waterfall i already found the sword no i already heard you talk to me i don't want to know anymore stop it important to explore every room of the dungeons because a lot of them are going to be filled with bullshit. Oh. I mean, you got to scour these dungeons every throbbing inch because they're probably you're going to miss a really important item like the raft that you need to get around in the rest of the game Boom. or this ladder thing that lets you mysteriously not climb anything but go across water. What is this Nintendo? And even though you find way more heart containers, you only ever start with three hearts. You got to go to this fairy every time you want to fill up before you go into a dungeon. And then you die in the dungeon and you continue and you only have three hearts and you're going to go back to the goddamn fairy. God damn it. God damn it. Especially when you're in a dungeon where none of the goddamn enemies drop any items at all. No health, no bombs, no nothing. So when you have to continue, you're fucked. All in all, I'd uh, give this game about 47 rupees. It's uh, It's got its problems, but uh, you know, it, the Zelda formula shows that it really works in this open world environment. And uh, the graphics seem uh, pretty okay. Uh, you know, the, the hardware is kind of getting older. Um, the Switch isn't the most powerful console, so there's that to bear in mind, but I think they've done a lot with the hardware. What the fuck is that thing, and why can't I hit? Why am I not hitting it? Why is it not being hit? Why? Why is the bombs aren't working? This hits are working sometimes. You know what? Fuck this game. I'll play something else. I got other games I can play. Other than this one, I'm out of here. No, I'm done. I have a stock market investment.